while we learn about the opposition on the pitch, Wiser learns how to heat my home. You've brought in uh, another young Welshman in Yeston Harris. Tell us a little bit about him and, and what you like. Uh, it, it, kind of everything, really. You know, it's you know, um, it, we were looking, we were looking to add a hooker um, to our senior squad uh, for for next season. Um, and obviously, when I was looking around, and, and Yeston's name came came down from his agent, um, sent me a few games of him playing uh, in the Welsh Premiership. Um, I had a good look at those. Kind of liked what I saw. Uh, Yeston came down, we did, did a medical, did an interview. He comes across very well, um, and he looks. He just looks like one of these guys who's got an ambition and got a dream and got a drive to be the best player he can be. We actually ended up getting him down, and we brought him down this season um, because he actually played in the Cardiff Toulouse game, Hiding Cup game, uh, and injured his shoulder. Um, and Cardiff were good enough to release him early to allow him to do two things, just to finish his rehab here but also start to integrate um, with us. And obviously with Luke Cowan Dickey's longish term injury, um, it pretty much means that there's an opportunity to be asked to break into the team now. Um, obviously I've got, you know, I've got to thank Di Young and Cardiff for allowing that to happen, they've helped us out a great deal. And it's allowed Yeston to get in and settle in and he certainly looks to me like a, a young hooker with a with a really big future. He's he's not been able to do flat out contact and flat out set pieces yet. He's just about getting there now. But in the next few weeks he might be one of those guys who you just see accelerate into a first team and be a be a driving force for us for, for seasons to come.